Well, hello and welcome to Vlogmas Day 9. I am at the Taco Bell parking lot because it's been a hot minute since I've actually been to Taco Bell and I've got like 40 minutes before my oil change appointment and I'm probably mm, about like 20, 25 minutes away, but I haven't eaten lunch yet and it's like 2.15 or something like that. So anyway, I figured I would like put you guys here and say hey. And um, you know, just catch up on the day, I guess. I don't know. Oh, fun fact. Oh, I'm wearing one of my new shirts from Old Navy from yesterday. So this morning I woke up, hold on, let me turn my like thing off, okay. Um, Woke up this morning and I had stuff in the dryer all night last night. Well, not like all night, but you know, like I just started it before bed because I had something in the wash and then I just put it in the dryer. So anyway, went to the bathroom before bed. Sorry if it's TMI, but you know, you gotta go to the bathroom and flush the toilet. And this morning I woke up and my toilet was like still running. So the, I don't know, whatever that plug is or whatever, didn't like seal properly, like in the tank. So it had been running all night long and I didn't hear it because usually, I've had that happen one other time with that toilet in question, but the only reason I didn't hear it is because it's like the main bathroom right outside of the laundry area. So it was already like kind of loud because the dryer was going. Anyway, I thought that was fun. So that's what happened this morning. And since Taco Bell has Pepsi products, which by the way, not not a favorite of the FDE, I get Sierra Mist because I can't, I, I, I don't like Pepsi. Sorry to all you Pepsi lovers out there. It's just on my back. So, you're all probably wondering like, what does she get? She's living moss. Like, I'm living like actual moss. Living the actual moss moss. So, I got two things. Because I don't know if it's even like possible to buy one thing at Taco Bell, like to eat. I think, I think it's required that you buy two. So, anyway, I got a, like it's on their dollar menu. It's the, the cheesy roll up. And then I got a soft taco. Pretty boring stuff. Pretty boring stuff. But I didn't really want to like eat in the dining room there. Cause I'm already like eating crap. I probably shouldn't be eating. So it's like full commitment. I don't like to commit fully. Only like partial way. Oh my gosh, there is like sauce like all over this thing. Why? <laughs> Oh, they gave me a soft taco supreme. I don't know. Whatever. I didn't order a soft taco supreme. It's fine. I can deal with some sour cream. That's fine. No big deal. And I love me some tomato so that all works out slick. But work was good today. Went by pretty fast. I had a lot of projects to do, so got a bunch of stuff done. And yeah, it was actually my first day at the location that I normally work at, um, working a Saturday. Cause I've been working in the Adina office. Um, every Saturday I've been working just like temporarily. So yeah, it's been good. Oh my gosh, don't fall. So anyway, have the oil change and then, oh, my brother had sent me that Target coupon for 20% off, so I made a list, and I'm gonna go to the Target. Um, a bunch of the groceries you actually saw me get the other day, about like, mm, I'd say like 60% of that, maybe seven, more like 70% of that, was actually for Christmas. Um, I was just kinda like stocking up on some stuff at Aldi. But um, there's some other things that I need at Target, and I figured the right by my oil, not right by my oil change place, but like a couple miles away is a super Target. So I figured I'd go there and then possibly attempt to get like grocery groceries, like like my apples that I eat every day and things like that, that like I don't like to buy at my Target because they're always like super tiny, like apples and they're 
priced not by the pound but like by the item like one apple is like X amount of dollars and it doesn't matter if it's like teeny tiny or like huge so I'd rather just buy it by the pound you know what I mean so anyway um all right so I am gonna eat the tacos and um, drink my drink and then I'm gonna go over and get my oil changed and run to Target and I'm not sure like when I'm gonna check in again but I will check in again so anyways all right this is nice and warm so time to eat bye well hello I am home I've actually been home for like several several hours it is like 10 I'm freaking tired but I just realized I hadn't checked in since I've been home, so hi. Um, got all my stuff done, so went to, oh, I ate my Taco Bell, as you saw. Well, you saw some of it. What did I do to my face? Okay, um, had the Taco Bell. Went to the oil change and then um, went to Target, so got all that done, which was great. And then um, tried to go to the pharmacy. Sorry, you guys are like a little dusty. You've been in my bag all day. Um, I tried to go to the pharmacy and like legit I was like two minutes late because they closed at 6 which I didn't think that the Walgreens pharmacy closed at 6 on Saturdays but apparently it does. It's not open tomorrow and I'm supposed to have my prescription tomorrow but it's no big deal. I'll just get it on Monday. Not a problem. So anyways, um, if you can see behind me there's an Erin Condren box like right, right there. There's also another one I don't want to like show my address but there's another one right there um okay so the last video I had posted was send me the new gutsmiths I'm pretty sure because I haven't uploaded today's or like yesterday's video and I'm not gonna get to it today you guys um I know that's like duh because this is like a day or two in the future but okay I reached out to them on social media on Facebook when all this stuff went down so just thinking like, oh, if someone was like on their team that could help me right away, that would be perfect. But they didn't get back to me until the morning and also the customer service when you like basically make a claim online when you like sign in on your online profile if there's an issue. Um, I emailed them as well just saying like, hey, I talked to the social media, blah, blah, blah. Um, no one's there. So I figured I would just, you know, do it here too. So anyway, before the customer service team got back to me with a resolution the social media team reached out to me on facebook and was like hey we see your issue we're just gonna send you out new guts then we'll email you a shipping label to ship back your bad guts so all the horizontal ones i'm shipping back and i said to them i said oh i've already been in communication with customer service but they haven't gotten back to me as to like what the resolution is and they said no problem we'll talk to customer service we'll just take care of it right now for you so we can next day air it out i'm like okay great that'd be perfect well seems as though they didn't communicate and i have two so i only have one shipping label and that's for supposed to be the horizontal guts so i'm gonna ask them if they want their other planners back um so yeah I need to email them which I haven't done yet but whatever and today was like Black Friday Cyber Monday shipping day because I got a bunch of stuff from World Market which I will show you hold on I'm like trying to not show you where I live is like kind of helpful um but yeah so I got some buffet napkins this is all from World Market um in this like cocoa brown color and then i also got them in black and then totally blaming my best friend in my head her name is kelly nan she runs a blog i'll put her blog down below i also follow her on instagram she's amazing and she is like a like a lifestyle blogger but she does more like home related stuff and i think she lives in georgia if i remember right and um i like i just love everything that she does but um she has been ranting and raving about these driftwood chargers um that she basically uses them for every occasion on her table and her tablescapes always look like absolutely gorgeous and i'm like you know i want to see these in person so um i think they were having like a what was it like a 25 or a 30% off or something like that 
And so I was like, you know what? I'll just get as many as I need of these. They came in a set of two. They're called the Driftwood Chargers. Um, let's see. So I got a total of eight of them, which means I put four in my cart because obviously they're a set of two and like math and stuff, right? So, but these are beautiful in person. They've also got like little felted, um, not felted, but like, I don't know, foamed feet on it too. I mean, I was supposed to like wash these, but it just says wipe with dry soft cloth. So yeah, I think these are gorgeous and they look really nice with white plates. Also, I ended up getting this thing, which is like super weird and awkward to show. Hold on. This thing, it's like a trough, like legit, it's a trough, you guys. Um, you're supposed to put like wine and stuff in there. I'm sorry about the mess. I need to like actually do something this weekend and like clean, but life, you know? So you're supposed to put like bottles of wine or champagne or something in there, but I thought it'd be really cute to put a bunch of ice in here because it's supposed to be for ice. Like this is like a removal, removal? A removable like galvanized little space for it. But I thought it'd be really cute to put in like obviously ice so you can like take the ice if you want to. But um, put in obviously like whatever bottle of wine that we're working on. And then also I have some like bottled beverages. So I have like glass bottled root beer and orange soda and stuff like for the holidays. So I just figured that would look cute in there. And I think, yeah, so I have it. So like that stuff put in there, you know what I mean? When I was at Target earlier, I'm not gonna do a Target haul because I already put all my crap away, but um, I, I basically bought food. That's weird. Um, I did buy a shirt, which is like, I don't know. I'm, I'm really boring with my clothes, you guys. You know, you already know that. But I did do this. <sighs> I'm gonna get judged by the internet. I did that. I did that. Here's all the naughty M&Ms. This is the naughty M&M show, let me tell you. Um, yeah, so I'm like digging the green, totally digging the green, see like that? Whoops, like that would be like an Instagrammable moment, right? Right, but like, oh, look at that red. Oh, it's so, oh, oh, oh so much better, so much better, right? Oh my gosh. So yeah, if you want, if anybody wants some red M&Ms, you just let me know, okay? Okay, preferably somebody I actually know that can just come over and come on over and take them off my hands. That'd be like super swell. Um, I'll probably just end up giving them to my brother or something. But yeah, that's, that's what I did. But now my little like battery light is flashing, so. Let me change the battery and then we'll go see the doodle dog. Okay, so new battery in. Uh-oh. I thought the doggy was upstairs. He's been here the whole time, creeping. Well, hey, Doyle. What, what are you doing? I know, I still have my fall pillow out. Don't touch me. Don't do it. Well, actually, you can do it, and you can do it in the comments if you want. <laughs> do Whoa, hi, doodle. Hello. <laughs> what you been doing all day, little guy? Huh? Yeah. I think everybody likes you better. We should just have like a Doyle dog live stream or something. You just watch the dog sleep because that's really what he does. And then, you know, if he hears food, then he comes on over. All right, buddy? All right? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, P.S. I've had it since I'm in the living room, right? Um, I've had actually had a few questions on where I get or where I got something. Hold, hold on. Oh my gosh, this dog. He's like, he knows he's on camera, so then he needs all the attention. Right, buddy? Right. Okay. Anyway, I've gotten some questions. Doyle, Doyle. Jeez. I've had some questions because this little guy has been like in the corner of some of my photos recently. This is one of those like Moroccan puff things. It's kind of like Kitty Wampus right now because I just had my feet on it for a little while. But I actually got mine at TJ Maxx on the internet, like online. Doyle, really? Okay. 
Um, so anyway, I got mine at TJ Maxx online, but they don't have them anymore. Cause once I finally got it shipped to me and I was like, oh, this thing is sweet. I want another one. So I want like one for here and like one for here. Um, they don't have them anymore, of course, because you know, like TJ Maxx, Marshall's Home Goods, like they just have what they have. And then when they run out, they run out and then they put like new stuff up all the time or this is so distracting by the way. Okay. Um, so anyway, I found this also, I think it was on Overstock because I wanted it to have the same exact design because there's a couple of them. Doyle. <laughs> um, there's a couple of them that have different, you know, like star designs or whatever in the center, but I wanted them to match and obviously be the same color and all of that. But yeah, I really like it. So, yeah, I got mine at TJ Maxx um, online, but then they didn't have them anymore. So now I got one from Overstock, which should be coming, I don't know, in the next week or two. But, yeah, it's, like, really nice when you sit down at the couch and then you put your feet up. It's, like, perfect. Right, Doyle? It's, like, nice and lounging. And then you can look at your beautiful tree and your beautiful dog. Right, Doyle? Are you beautiful? Yep. You're such a beautiful dog, Doyle. You're such a beautiful dog. But I think that's gonna be it for today. I am really tired. Like I said, it's like past, I think it's past 10 now. And it is time to go to bed. And I am so excited to sleep in tomorrow. I'm gonna sleep in, I'm gonna get some stuff done, and then I'm also gonna like edit my face off because I've got, I think, one video. I think I have one video that's on my computer that's not a vlog that I want to edit and get up this upcoming week. And it's like a budget thing. I mean, it's not, it's not my budget. A lot of people have been asking me about the budget. And it's just not happening right now. And that's okay. But it's going to be like financially related content is coming up this week. So, um, so yeah, I'm excited to uh, share some stuff with you guys. But I also want to enjoy my day off too. But... I think part of enjoying the day off is just kind of like getting stuff done around here. Hello, Doyle. Okay, okay, okay. Can I throw it to you? Is that what you want? Well, well. He's got the little zoom zooms. He's got those zoomies. Oh my gosh, he's so excited about life right now. So anyway, speaking of tomorrow, I'm gonna try to chill out, but I still need to get a bunch of crap done. And I think part of the crap I need to get done is I need to make a list, like a big ass list of all the things I need to do, all the things I still have to get but like I'm talking about like the Christmas celebration thing that's happening like the Saturday before Christmas I need to make a list of all of like the ingredients I need for all the food and then also like some of the stuff I can't get until like the week of which is totally fine but just all those like little things that I might be missing like I'm not a baker but I'm like baking a cake right um but I need oh I need to go to the liquor store um, because my cake has rum in it. It's a rum cake. It's so good, by the way. So, so good. And, um, yeah, so I need, like, flour and sugar. Like, I don't have that because why would I need flour and sugar? Well, to make a rum cake. <laughs> but anyway, but I just need to make a really big list so then I, like, feel, like, more accomplished with my life to say, you know... I do have my crap together and I can cross a bunch of crap off my list and then it makes me feel better. And then it just like gives me a visual of like, okay, here's the things you need to do and you've got this many days to do it. Like, you know, devise a plan and just do it or do like a little bit of it like every day when you get home. Doing it little by little is good too because I want to be able to like enjoy my brother being here and enjoy my nephew and um, you know, the kids and Heidi and everybody. Like I want to be able to just like hang out and have a good time with everyone. So. Anyway, making lists, hanging out, doing stuff that's all so contradictory of each other, but whatever, we're going to go with it. But anyway, 
Um, that's my long winded way of saying I'm gonna go and I'm gonna see you guys tomorrow. Hope you're having a good day and I will see you soon. Bye.